Hey folks, it's Mike. Um, I'm at uh, basically in the Whiteshell area of uh, Manitoba um, and uh, starting off sort of my day at uh, Whitemouth uh, Falls Provincial Park and uh, I'm gonna take uh, a little, you know, some photos of the area around here, um, see what I can do. So, yeah. Let's not lose this filter in well, the water, the bag, whatever. So let's make sure it's actually screwed on properly. Anytime now. Come on. So what I'm trying right now is um, a repeat of something I did last month um, and I didn't really record, I think. I don't remember. But basically, uh, it's going to be a, a three-shot sort of focus slash time um, stack where um, I'm essentially, uh, let me just turn this off for a moment, where essentially what I'm going to do is focus on sort of the rocks and the water here and do about it. All right, so um, before I was rudely interrupted by my dead battery, um, basically what I'm gonna do is a three shot uh, focus slash time stack where um, on the rocks and the water down here, I'm gonna do like a 20 second exposure and focus on that. And then the water you see over there and, and the rocks up there, I'm gonna focus on that and do about a two and a half second exposure. And off in the distance there with the, the trees, since it's a little breezy, uh, probably something like a one one hundredth of a second, um, just to sort of stop the motion of the trees because I don't, you know, want, um, you know, tree uh, leaves blowing around and such. Uh, and, uh, I probably should also explain, I'm doing this with an ND filter slapped on, okay, screwed on to uh, my camera here, um, as you may have seen, but uh, yeah, um, I'll uh, see if I can repeat the success with some fall colors.
suppose if Weird Al actually grew up in cottage country, he would have been singing like a sturgeon. Get it? Stur- stur- You guys suck. <sighs> yeah, I do think uh, camping here in the fall would actually be quite nice. And with the leaves and the uh, slightly cooler weather. Um, you know, not sub-zero yet. Um, yeah, I, uh, I wouldn't complain too much. I'd probably need a tent, sleeping bag, firewood, uh, laptop maybe, you know, watch some YouTube videos. I know a channel. Okay, so it's composing a great shot here. However, the light on the picnic table just suddenly went away. Come back, son. Please? Pretty please? Ah, cool, play structure. Of course, I'm looking at this play structure and thinking, if it weren't for the uh, the cheery primary colors here, you know, the greens, the yellows, the reds, this could almost be considered a torture rack. You know, hang yourself up here. Although it would be good for my back. Hmm. Yeah, with that slide, I'm getting stuck um, right at the top, and uh, my butt's too big for that. It's not gonna work. Yeah, I might fit, but I might also end up falling head over heels and face first into the sand and leave, so that's a no. How about here? Uh, same idea. Hmm. Let's see. Here? Could I use it? No. Uh, knowing me, I'll get my feet dangled and end up with second degree burns from, you know, friction. And a couple broken bones, easily. So, no. Of course, I'm ima easily imagining myself uh, camping out here uh, in summer, uh, in the warm days of fall like today, um, you know, and enjoying a nice uh, early morning dip in the water, regardless of how cold it would be, uh, you know, nice late night by the campfire, um, northern lights out over the lake, yeah, it sounds, sounds pretty good to me. Okay, I'm at Opapaska campground. It says no pets. Well, crap. I wanted to bring Henry and Yuki. Sorry boys, I can't bring you. Unless... Hmm.
Of course, the first time I was here was probably be about late September in 2019, I want to say. Because uh, I came here and wanted to take uh, photos of the northern lights from here with, you know, the stars and the lights reflecting off of the, uh, off the water here. Um, and it was very nice. Um, there's even a little bit of fog sort of um, towards the shoreline on the opposite side there. So it sort of kind of looked pretty nice. It's interesting to see what this place looks like in the daytime. Um, actually, you know what? I'll throw it. I'll throw a, a, a photo here, there, uh, everywhere, whatever, uh, of uh, some, one or two of the photos from, uh, from that night. Congratulations, Pam. It's a boy. Get it? Boy, boy, boy. You guys suck. Sheesh. Plenty of sand around. I could build a neat sand castle. Maybe uh, bury myself in the sand, you know, with like a, a sand tail, make myself look like a sand mermaid or something like that. The only problem is I, I didn't bring a shovel or, or a bucket. <sighs> Next time. So uh, yeah, just like uh, just like Rushing River last month, August 23. If you're viewing this well into the future, um, yeah, the White Shell is is a very beautiful area. Um, rocky, yes. Lots of trees, yes. Lots of sand, yes. Lots of water, yes. Kind of checks a lot of uh, a lot of boxes there. Um, Again, I wouldn't complain if I ended up retiring here. It'd be really nice. Alright, made it out to uh, Nudebeek. Uh, here's the, the boat launch area. And uh, I don't know, does, does royalty come out and smash a bottle of baby duck on that boat to, to launch it? Oh. I don't I don't have boats, so I couldn't tell you. Of course I have been thinking. Um, I I've I've got some presets in, in Lightroom that give you know, um, seeing some sort of, you know, bumps and oranges, yellows, reds, greens, you know, give it more of a fall look. And uh, of course, I'm also interested in maybe trying some sort of vintage type of edit, sort of, you know, remind me of what thing life was like back in the, the early 80s. Also, I remember seeing a uh, photo recently of uh, a couple from like, I'm going to guess it was mid-70s, early 70s maybe, and there was a lot of sort of brown and orange and yellow tones in it, and yeah. I'd like to see if I can copy, well, not copy, but emulate that style, sort of. Give it a shot, take some photos around here, like the boat launch, uh, I'm going to cross the, the road to also uh, get um, the, the forest area there as well, and uh, yeah.
Okay, um, I'm, I'm done, uh, sort of my grand tour of uh, white shell. Um, there's a lot more to go, but I don't got enough time because I've got two cats at home, they're gonna gnaw my arm off. Which one, I don't know. Probably this one, because this is the first one to probably be in the door. Uh, so on that note, uh, I'm out. So do the usual, like, comment, subscribe. Ciao, folks.